You're watching HCTV and we're here at CS 2010 in Las Vegas and we're at the Parrot Stand where they've got something really cool which is a four blade helicopter called the AR Drone. That's it down there. Cedric here is our pilot and the idea of this thing is uh, it's a really easy to fly helicopter. Um, underneath, if I put my hand under here, it should go up because it's got some little sensors under here which knows how far it is away from the floor which means it's really difficult to crash so if you cut the power it will just drop down and then hover and then land itself nice and softly on the floor. Um, it's got accelerometers in there so it knows all the attitudes where it is, um, little gyroscopes and there's also a uh, camera underneath which shows um, how far it is from the floor as well so it knows pretty much where it is in space at any one time. It auto stabilizes as you can see now, lovely solid, um, this isn't Cedric doing anything, it's just hands off, okay, but the really cool thing is at the very front of it, it's got a video camera so if you have a look up here, this is a live feed from the actual helicopter itself. Cedric, can you make it point at me? Yeah. There we go. Here we go. So if I get in front of that like that, there you are. You see, that's the actual feed coming from the camera as the helicopter is being flown around. And, it's, and the really, really cool thing, back on me, the really, really cool thing is that it's all flown from your iPhone. Okay? So you use the tilt and twist on the iPhone yeah, to actually control the helicopter. So if you give it a little tilt around, um, if you've got a couple of little controls on the iPhone itself, so there's uh, one which controls the vertical speed, so that makes it go up and down. This one is rotation, and then to actually fly it forward, you tilt the iPhone this way, you tilt it back to fly back, um, side to side, makes it go side to side. Really, really simple to do, really easy to fly, that's right, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Okay, now we're just going to do a very quick cut, because um, founder of Hexus, uh, David Ross, really, really wants to go to flying at this, so he's going to have a crack, and we're going to see just how awful it all is. Uh, so we're going to cut now, and David's going to take over. So here we go, this is David flying this for the first time. We'll see just how easy this is. He's never flown this before. Off we go then, David. Go over there. Up, go up. See if you can take it over Luke's head. <laughs> Luke's looking a bit nervous. How easy is it? It's, it is pretty easy actually. It's quite sensitive, but the best thing is when you when you let go. Of this, there's a button up. Big Chris. Big yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm a pro. <laughs> Don't worry about little things like that. Um, <laughs> and when you when you there's a button that you can just let go of and it, it just, just goes into water, yeah. it? Can you turn it? Actually rotate it. Um, I don't know how to do that, right? I guess it's this button. Cool. Yeah. And the other thing is, obviously, on the screen here, you can see that the camera is coming straight through to the phone. Like the pilot's eye view. Yeah, it's great. But I, don't, I, don't, I should just watch the so screen, you can fly right? It just by looking at the. No, let's not kid myself. Yeah. Okay, so one of the things that they're going to be doing with this is they're going to be release, releasing a software developer kit to allow uh, stuff called augmented reality, which basically means that through the iPhone itself, what they'll do is it'll overlay like a, a 3D world and you'll be flying around in reality and then you'll have things like robots pop up or whatever developers want to do. So you can then basically have like a, a flight sim game where you're attacking enemies on the iPhone um, using an overlay which is seen through the camera itself. So you can set markers around your house to basically say like, you know, this is the boss entrance or whatever. Um, it's basically whatever they want to do. Um, and so you can basically play full-on augmented reality games. Um, and tilting the iPhone, I think, is actually still controlling it. No, no, no. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's gone out there. So there you go. That's the, um, that's the AR drone from Parrot. Um, Cedric, when is this going to come out? What? When is this going to be uh, available to buy? Uh, on, on this year. This year? Yeah. Okay. Any idea how much? How much? Uh, it's uh, just um, a project. We are not, not yet. We don't know. Okay. It's been really popular, uh, yeah, the show there, hasn't it? Yeah, it's a very popular. A lot of people uh, see uh, this drone. It's a, it's a very, uh, very interesting project. Uh, 
Fantastic. Right. So there we go. That's the AR drone from Parrot. Uh, check back soon on Hastings TV for more from CS 2010.